I've had an extremely shitty month and yesterday just made it even shittier. So, I decided to hit the local strip club to drown my sorrows in overpriced alcohol and semi-nude women. I ended up talking to one very attractive girl, and while I know the women pay to act like they're interested in you, this was somehow different. After a lap dance I told her about some of the drama that has been happening in my life. She seemed genuinely interested and concerned about me and then asked if I had a cell phone, which I did. She said, text me, and gave me her number, which I did. I left around midnight thinking that would be the end of the story. But it wasn't because at about 2.15am, she texted me and asked if I was awake. I was, and it started a text conversation which led to her coming over to my place and the two of us engaging in sex. With each other. RMA. OMG. What's it like having sex with another human being? It's the most amazing thing ever. Until immediately after. At which point, you potentially feel very dirty and ashamed. You're doing it right. Five. Fist bump. How much? Free. Well, except for the $80 or so I spent that night at the club. So, what happened next? Has she texted you at all? She texted me this morning to let me know she got home safe. I then wrote back saying I had a fun night and she followed with a smiley face. Other than that, nothing. Did you use protection? Did you ask if she has any STDs? She claimed to have not had sex in three months since she broke up with a guy and said she had been tested earlier in the year. I'm actually pretty shocked at myself for asking the question, because I've never done that. Although, I didn't ask until after we were done doc and yes, condom was used. So, gonna call her back? We'll see. I actually don't live in the area although I grew up here. I don't have any plans of starting a relationship though. I think she's aware of all of that and probably thinks the same thing. Honestly, this was probably a sympathy fuck. What's wrong with you man? Or what's wrong with her? She must be hot and she seems nice. Why wouldn't you go pursue it a little more to see how it goes? I'm not going to not pursue it. I've never done that friend with benefits thing and I don't see this as being anything more than that. So, not really sure how to proceed. Well, for what it's worth, I totally regretted passing on an affair with a stripper. She was great. I just had a kid on the way so I made the responsible choice, but glad I did. Do you know anything about her, or is she just a fake name, fake boobs and a hell of a ride to you? If I'm to believe her, then yes I do know her real name, where she's from originally and some other info about her. She was a very petite girl, so the boobs were definitely real, 